Here's how to solve 2D projectile motion problems in physics. So in this example, we have a ball being launched at an angle from the top of a building, and we're asked to figure out how far the ball lands from the base of the building. Now I know there are a lot of numbers in this problem, but here's a general strat to make it easy. Anytime you have an object moving in both the up, down, and the left, right direction, the key is to write out the kinematics equations separately for each direction. Then you solve for the time t in one direction and plug it into the same t into the other one. In this case, we're looking for the distance the ball travels in the x direction, which will be related to the time it takes for the ball to fall in the y direction, from the top of the building to the ground. Now choosing which kinematics equation to solve with, we're going to use this second one, because in this problem we're not given, nor are we asked to find the final velocity. The next step is to write out our kinematics equations in each direction. Now when writing these out, you'll notice that there are two initial velocities, one for the x direction and one for the y direction. However, in this question, we are given only one value for the initial velocity, 20 meters per second. But this is a velocity that points in both the x and y direction. 